what do you need for automating a factory? So there are like about six or seven different attributes. One is collecting data from sensors. Uh, you, the other is maybe transferring recipes up and f back and forth. Uh, you, you want to control the equipment. Maybe uh, so two-way communication is important. So there is about six different aspects. If you look at it, most protocols have some aspect of that. Uh, the GEM protocol that's semiconductor, that does all of it, right? So if I were in, in your shoes, then I would just take the protocol that works, then work with the equipment vendor to make sure that they upgrade the equipment or provide the protocol on the equipment, and then work with a software vendor that provides a platform that can connect to that, that uh, equipment in a matter of hours. There is no reason why a standard protocol needs to be programmed or takes uh, days or months. So there is a whole industry that does uh, equipment integration uh, in my opinion, that's not required because if you are using a standard, you should be able to talk to the machine, figure out what it can do and do that. So that's kind of what I, I would say that a whole line can be done in a matter of uh, an afternoon.